How are my beautiful subscribers doing? This is after Christmas, Dad. How was your Christmas experience? It was above average. Above average? What's average for you on a Christmas day? Uh, well, actually, the way we do it is we open one present at night. Mm -hmm. Christmas the night Eve. before Christmas Eve. It can't, it can't be a really good one. You know, it can't be one of the special ones. Of course. No, no. You, you, you select it out for us, and then we choose which one. Right, right. You get a choice of a couple. And then yeah, in the morning, and mm -hmm. then in the morning before your parents get up, which now... We get up before you do because you sleep in. Yeah, that is very true. Uh, you guys are allowed to open the stockings mm -hmm. without us. And then once everybody arrives with grandparents and everybody, we open our gifts one the at whole a time. Here. Yep. Yep. And, and so that made me think about what do other people do? Do other people open up? Because I've heard of yeah, people who open I, I, all I up. know everybody has all these crazy, like, I, I don't want to say rituals, but no, like. they are. Okay, okay, crazy Christmas rituals. Tell us down in the comment section below because that's where you guys are supposed to tell us. We want to know, like, what what is your, you know, your what what do you, do you think do is different? Your Christmas ritual, you know, we have it where we open it on Christmas Eve, the night before Christmas, and then we open up stockings and we wait for the the other whole crew, the family, the aunts, uncles, grandparents, all to get here, and then we start the extravagant advan the yeah, extravagant the, i, I want to look for a word the, extravagant, the extravaganza the extravaganza of opening yes. all the gifts okay and that made me start thinking about you know what that's america and we do things a certain way and oh, i'm already, sure there's other crazy things out there yeah and, and a bunch of different countries i mean think about it in america we hang socks for, over our fireplace and they get filled up that's kind of an interesting yeah i mean thing, it'd right? be weird if they got filled up with other things like I, I mean we have like all these little stocking stuffers or whatever but I've heard of like people putting oranges in there. Yeah, yeah, and you know, I heard Dutch people actually put out shoes. I don't know if they're wooden shoes. Like, like, wait, what? Oh, for their shoes to get filled yeah, instead yeah. of socks. Right. All yeah. right. Okay. So, I mean, so, how am I supposed to argue with that when we put out socks? Now, what do we yeah, exactly? What do we leave for Santa? What do Ooh. we leave out for Santa? <sighs> we leave out cookies and ice cream. Well, no, I, no, I just took a guess. Cookies and milk. I know, I know. Of course, it's cookies and milk. Guess what they leave for uh, out in Australia? What the kids leave out uh, for Santa? Steak. I want to be Santa in Australia because they leave him beer. Beer. I want beer. beer. Yeah. And I'm, so, wait. Oh my gosh! Think what? about how drunk he is. Oh, I know. I know. Like, think about how many beers he's just gone through and gone through over and over. He is so drunk right now. Well, in Australia, he Whoa. is. Oh my gosh! And I think they're ahead of us. So. Oh, yeah, They're so so future. when he gets to our house, oh, he's man. super drunk. Well, unless he's sobered up on the on the fly over <laughs> the ocean. I, I guess it's a possibility, but, I mean, when you drink, like, 400,000 gallons of beer... Yeah, that would be a lot. That's that, a lot of beer, Dad. I, I dare you to top that. No, you'd kill no. me. It would kill me. <laughs> but Santa's magical. Santa's okay, witchcraft. So in South Africa, on Christmas, they eat caterpillar the, of the emperor moth, fried in oil. Oh, where is that again? In, in South Africa. Ah. Uh, how do you even yeah. know that exists? Yeah, I don't know. Why why would you celebrate that for Christmas? I mean, Merry I like Christmas have some caterpillar. Yeah, no, I like I like the candy canes. Uh, you know, those are yeah, those are candy good. canes are some fudge. definitely a, a different thing that I like. <laughs> fudge is good. <laughs> fudge is way better than caterpillar. Okay, did you know in one at one point there there's a parade and there's 18,000 people that dress up like Santa? That's a lot of Santas. Yeah, and that would throw children off. Oh man. my gosh, They're thinking like, about every corner. Oh, it's Santa, Santa, Santa. Give me all my presents. If all of them had a present for me, no, that that, that, that that'd be cool. But you know, that's think about it. the parents drive around. They have to tell the kids, you know, well, that's one of Santa's helpers. That's not the official Santa. Or Santa's so fake, fast, fake Santa. Yeah, that that he's right there. Yeah, okay. he loses weight. He gains weight. He turns different skin colors. <laughs> True. It's just how it goes, dude. I mean, little kid, you got to get that in your head. Well, you're lucky you don't live in Spain. Okay, speaking of little kids. All right. Uh, because in Spain they have Saint Nicholas, right? Nicholas. Okay. Yeah, Saint Saint Nicholas. But they also have Zwarte Pete or Black. I love Zwarte Pete. Black Peter. You don't love Zwarte. I don't know what he does. I just he's, heard that name for the first he's a, time. He's a demonic dwarf. Oh, um, why? Why? In the, in the in the Netherlands, you'll find out. In the Netherlands and or Belgium, <laughs> um, they have they celebrate or they honor or they acknowledge Zwarte Piet. Zwarte Piet. Now Zwarte Piet lives in a coal mine in Spain. Okay, okay. Coal and mine. he's and he's and he's black not because of his skin color. He's black because of the soot and all the coal dust from where he lives. Okay, it makes sense. So his job is to watch the kids all year long, <sighs> um, and then he comes out through his tunnels in the coal mine <laughs> and he rides on a coal cart. Okay, so okay, okay, yeah, I know what you're talking about, like those temple run things that you run into. Right, yeah. exactly. And he's pulled by uh, plague-ridden rams. Undone. Rams. I, rams. I, I rarely know, ever hear of that animal, but okay. Yeah, it's a football team. But Oh, yes. I, I know what the animal is. Oh, I'm yeah. just saying it's just not a highly talked about animal. Yeah, it's not in our Christmas story. Mm -mm. Um, okay, so and then the bad kids, Zwarte Peter, Black Peter comes to them, yeah. and he gives them coal. 
Okay. Or a yeah, bundle of sticks. Ritual. Yeah, a sticks. Bundle, bundle of sticks. And and guess this, this if you're really bad. Now, if I was a kid growing up in Spain and I heard a black beater, you know, when when you don't when you're bad and we used to threaten you, hey, you're not going to get what you want for Christmas, so you get a piece of coal in your stocking or whatever because Santa's mad yeah, at yeah, you. Yeah, yeah, because he, okay? he's a rager. Well, Zwarte Pete will if take the really really big bad kids the terrible ones the terrible ones he puts them in a sack Ooh. with rats that are hungry ah that no no that's he like takes the them, book that i just read he takes them back to the coal oh. mine and makes them slaves and, they, and their job is they have to dig coal okay oh. and while while zorte pete black peter pokes them with pins ah. and if they stop digging the coal zorte pete eats them Eats them. I'd rather just say, Zwarte P, just eat me now. Yeah, well. Eat me now. I, I cannot take the pins. That would be awful. I'm Wait, glad we don't have that Christmas tradition. Me you, too, but if you think about it, yes. I, I, I saw this in an episode of Jimmy Neutron. Okay. A long time ago, because I don't know where Jimmy is. I think he got into meth or something. Yeah, <laughs> yeah. you know how those child stars are. <laughs> yeah, always into meth. But yes. either way, I, I want to know. I think Cole like, makes diamonds. Yeah, yeah. Well, yes, absolutely. So when Zwarte Pete gives me coal... Is he kind of like subliminally giving me diamonds for doing bad? Well, it's a potential diamond, but there's a lot of pressure and other other uh, environmental factors. So yeah, I, yes. ni- that's a nice spin. I'm, I'm glad you're trying to make something Zwarte, positive. Thank you. It reminds me of the little boy who's digging through the pile of manure and says, there's got to be a pony in here somewhere. You know, there, a, a pony? Yeah, because of all the poop manure. Yeah. Yeah. Well, no, okay. I, well, you're sense. trying to make make a diamond out of coal, and it's dude, not it works. Happen. It's it's science. Sure. Okay. All right. Ukrainian Ukrainian people they decorate Christmas trees all right. with fake we spider webs. Oh, we don't do that too. No, because because they're think about it. The spider web. Why would you want a spider web? Why? On a Christmas tree? I, I want to know. Explain. Well, the the ritual or the the rumor or the mythology is that when the sun comes up, it turns the webs into silver. So it's like free silver. Right, right. I, I don't understand how, you know, when the sun mm. comes up and it doesn't turn into silver, how that doesn't kind of give away the whole thing. But yeah, that, that's kind of that's like what they believe. Uh, fake. Or, or maybe maybe the parents take it away before the kids wake up there you and go. say like, oh, it was silver. We sold it and we bought some so, more Christmas So presents. now you got spider webs in your tree and lying parents. Okay. In, <sighs> in Venezuela, this, this would be kind of fun. On Christmas Eve, people rollerblade or skate to church. So okay, in, in oh, like on actual Christmas Day. Yeah, Christmas. Well, Christmas Eve. Oh, know. okay, Christmas Eve. So that would be kind of hard for us since our church is like kind of across town and yeah, it involves so, a freeway. And I don't and I don't skate very well. So. Yeah, no. <laughs> yeah, hey, I could skate. Pro- no, I can't. No, actually. no, you can't. Nope. Okay, so now how about this? Reindeer around the world. Okay, so Santa in in America or we're in Eastern whatever we are, Northern, yeah, yeah. Northern European. Um, he he is pulled by. He's pulled what's by he? What's he pulled by? Reindeer. Let's, reindeer. Reindeer. Okay, yes. yes. Reindeer. Reindeer. That, that's yeah, Dasher it. That's it. Yeah. And Dancer and Prancer and Rudolph. Yes. yes. Okay. Don't forget um, Vixen. At, okay. In Switzerland, <laughs> he rides. Yeah, a, yeah. He rides a donkey. A donkey. Yes. Like he, Jesus. Santa. Santa. Yes. Santa Jesus. Santa on, Jesus. On a donkey. Yeah. What did ever? What did Jesus ever do for Santa on his birthday? That's my question. Yeah. Yeah. Tell us down. We. <laughs> <laughs> what, what did he do? All right. Netherlands. Uh, Santa mm-hmm. rides a horse. All right. Okay. In Hawaii. What do you Ooh. think Santa rides? Santa rides a, an ape. Wrong. He paddles a canoe. <laughs> I'm he does. Done. In Hawaii. It's over. No, Santa it's paddles over. a canoe in Hawaii. Really? Okay, now this is a, an interesting Facts, one. In the, in the Czech Republic, okay. Okay. Santa is dropped from heaven on a golden cord. There are no reindeer. On a golden cord that like pull him back up? I imagine it's a bungee because otherwise how does yeah. he get from house to house? Yeah, that's, I, I don't know how that works. No, and uh, Australia. Who, who controls the court? Oh, it's elves. It's elves. Okay, well, heavy. I, I, I solved my question right there. <laughs> I guess, but what if you have really heavy, heavy presence? You know. Oh, you, dude, think about how heavy Santa is after all that beer from Australia. <laughs> That's right. I don't know if the Czech Republic is further really heavy. east or west from, but, but yeah. I, think about how wet, how east Australia is. Yeah, it's it's well, it's all the way on the other side of the earth. So. Wait, oh, okay. If we no, no, no. What? I was thinking if we look at a map, is it like? Oh, I, I'm just no. I'm different. Sorry, okay. Sorry, speaking and kids. speaking of Australia, I'm different. What do you think Santa rides or is is pulled by in Australia? Uh, beer. Nice try. Uh, no, it's it's this one's so obvious you're gonna hate yourself. Uh, a kangaroo. Oh, a kangaroo. wow! I'm not surprised. That'd be a very very bumpy ride. Yeah, and it, were, it probably works good because Santa can keep all the presents in the kangaroo's pouch. Yeah, of course. You know, I mean, think about 
He doesn't oh, have to hold the that, bag. That, that kangaroo's going to rip. That would be handy. Ugh. Okay, and the last weird uh, across yeah, the world Christmas, Christmas, Christmas ritual. Christmas, yes, is uh, in India, they don't decorate pine trees or fir trees like we do here in America. They decorate banana trees with ornaments. <laughs> so so they bring, are the bananas yeah. kind of their ornaments? No, no, they actually... They, 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 like, well, they there's decorate a picture it like us. One. It's just like, well, we'll throw up a picture of it right now. Yeah, because... Uh, just because it's Christmas doesn't mean you have to do everything like we do. You don't. That's have, true. Santa we're different. Have if we were there, here. we'd be doing it. Yeah, I mean, why not? I mean, mm -hmm. think about it. You walk around in shorts at Christmas in uh, in India. Oh yeah, I can't imagine the humidity. Yeah, and you get good ban bananas out of it too. Mm -hmm. That's so, true. Free bananas. So I prefer our Christmas traditions. I always want to watch the movie Elf myself and Christmas. Elf's a good Christmas movie. Story. Elf's a good movie. They should make an Elf too. Yeah, yeah. I don't know that they could do as well. You know, the sequels are never quite as good. That is true. But hopefully you guys did enjoy this video. Make sure to leave a like rating because I do love it when you like it. And so does my dad. Is that right, dad? I love it when you like it. Let's shoot for 250 likes for Christmas Day or for we're talking about Christmas Day. It's been Quad MFT and the Quad Father. Check our social media links down in the description below. My dad's will be down there too. check out his Twitter at Quad Father MFT. It's been Quad MFT and the Quad Father. And we'll be seeing you guys in the next video. And I I will see you with Black Peter.